at the end of this video you will learn how to solve quartiles for group data using OGIVE which is cumulative frequency graph we have seen how to calculate quartiles using formula method however in this second method we are going to use OGIVE to achieve this consider this question in a company work study investigation the time taken by 20 men to complete a particular job were tabulated as shown below calculate for the lower quartile middle quartile upper quartile and interquartile range and we have to calculate this using cumulative frequency graph step number one draw a frequency distribution table like this step number two fill out the class interval step three fill out the frequency and next you sum up the frequencies which is 20. step four compute for the lower class boundary which is 0.5 less than the lower class step five compute for the upper class boundary which is 0.5 greater than the upper class step six compute for the cumulative frequency using the frequency column start by writing out two then two plus four is six six plus six is twelve twelve plus four is sixteen sixteen plus three is 19 and 19 plus 1 is 20 using the completed table we are going to plot the cumulative frequency on the y axis and the upper class boundary on the x axis however our lowest point will be 7.5 the lowest value in the cumulative frequency is 2 and the highest value is 20. On the y axis, we got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, and 20. And these are the upper class boundaries. However, this is from the lower class boundary. Let's start the plot with 7.5 and here we got 7.5. Next, when the cumulative frequency is 2, the upper class boundary is 10.5, which is this point. Next, when the cumulative frequency is 6, the upper class boundary is 13.5, which is here. Next. When the cumulative frequency is 12, the upper class boundary is 16.5, which is this point. Next, when the cumulative frequency is 16, the upper class boundary is 19.5, which is this point. Next, when the cumulative frequency is 19, the upper class boundary is 22.5, which is this point and when the cumulative frequency is 20 the upper class boundary is 25.5 which is this point next join all the points hence this is the ogive curve next to calculate for the lower quartile we first find the lower quartile position using this formula when you substitute, you get 5.25 position. And from the cumulative frequency column, the 5.25 position is here. We trace it down. And this is the lower quartile, which is 12.5. And our lower quartile is 12.5. Next, we calculate for the middle quartile position using this formula. 
when you substitute the position is on the 10.5th position this is the 10.5th position we trust then we trace it down and this is 15.5 which is the middle quartile hence our middle quartile is 15.5 next for us to find the upper quartile we need the upper quartile position using this formula when you solve this carefully you get 15.75 this is 15.75 we trace it down and this is 18.5 the upper quartile is 18.5 and the interquartile range is the upper quartile minus the lower quartile which is 6 this is statistics to locate other videos, follow the link on the screen. The next topic is Pareto charts. I will see you in the next video.